Go fast, 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 and then skid. I'm closing my eyes. How old are you, Kate? Okay. How old are you? I'm four. Okay. My love of riding really started early. I think I just fell in love with being outside and being out on Mount Tam. For me, that love of being out, love of being on the mountain was really seen through the bicycle. So I grew up at the base of a mountain and I think that has really shaped who I am. I've always been looking up and wanting to see what's up there, wanting to go, wanting to explore. And I think I really got to explore that with my dad growing up. My earliest memory of Kate on a bicycle was riding the tandem when she was maybe five years old. She uh, was able to fit on the back and we would ride up and down Mount Tam. There's nothing more fun for me than, uh, than going out for a ride with her, and I, I take that opportunity every time I can get it. Ultimately, the process is your life. The process of getting better at mountain biking, the process of preparing for races and traveling and eating dinner before the races, those are 90% of my life. Those peak performance days are maybe 1%. Where's your sister? I have something for you guys. I'm not fine. Well, I never get yeah. so Like, at you. How did you get that one? The community in our area is really cycling oriented, and it's the home of mountain biking. Legend has it that mountain biking was invented on Repack, which is a fire road not far from my house on Mount Tam. And I grew up riding there. And I think at the time, it wasn't necessarily so meaningful to me, I didn't recognize that. But it surrounded me with this idea that mountain biking is special and that the mountain is special. My first race, which many people don't know, was a high school mountain bike race. It was at Fort Ord um, in 2010. This is the medal for my first mountain bike race ever. East Garrison, freshman, first place. There we go. So this was at Fort Ord. This was my first World Cup number ever. So it's 130. While in previous sports I'd love training, I think I'm someone who particularly enjoys that and, and loves that pursuit and that progress. I also love racing. It was so exciting. It's this like peak experience. And it's not just physical, it's tactical, and it's mental, and it's technical, and it requires you to focus, and all of these elements coming together in the right combination, and a little luck for you to have a great day. I, I'm going to try to catch that on the descent. Um, I never started mountain biking to win. I started to see how fast and how far I could go on my bike. I believe it. From the United States of America, Kate Courtney rewrites the history books. What a win for the young American. The tears are going to come. To see what happened in Lindsay Hyde and and to be there and experience it, it was an incredibly emotional day for all of us. To see all that come through for her was just an unbelievable experience. What has been your highlight so far? Oh, thank you, that's so nice. Seeing fans that genuinely want you to do well and are excited you're there and, and came to watch you, that's an incredible thing. Like that's so unique and rare in life to 
take an extra moment to sign a jersey for a kid or to talk to them about their mountain bike might actually make a difference in what they do. And, and that's something that's so special and that I have the opportunity to do. I really see that support and those fans as fuel pushing me forward and as people pulling for me. The impact that she's having, and particularly on, on kids and, and girls, it's extraordinary. And to see her kind of touch people and have them get as excited as they are, you know, as a 22-year-old to be able to win the world championship, that's motivating people to believe that, that it's possible, that, uh, that they can achieve maybe their biggest dream if they work hard enough.